Hey there, DIY enthusiasts. Are you ready to revamp your living space and give it a fresh new look? Well, today is your lucky day because I've got 10 incredible DIY projects that will transform your living space. Yes, you heard that right. 10 amazing projects coming right up. In today's video, we will discuss project number one, which is accent wall with peel and stick wallpaper. If you're new here, my name is Carmelita. If you're returning, welcome back. As usual, grab a cocktail or your beverage of choice um, and enjoy. Create a stunning focal point in any room with peel and stick wallpaper, such as I have here. It's easy to apply and can be changed when you want a new look. Creating an accent wall can dramatically transform a room. Here's a step-by-step -step guide to help you create an accent wall using peel and stick wallpaper. Materials needed. Peel and stick wallpaper. Measuring tape. A level. Pencil. Scissors or utility knife. Smoothing tool. You can use something like a plastic scraper. And last but not least, if needed, you can also use a ladder. Step-by-step -step guide. First, choose the wall. Select the wall you want to accent. Typically, it's the wall that naturally draws attention, such as the wall behind the bed, sofa, or dining table. Step number two, measure the wall. Measure the height and width of the wall to determine how much wallpaper you'll need. Add an extra 10% to your measurements to account for trimming and mistakes. Prepare the wall. Clean the wall surface to remove dust and grease. Ensure it is smooth and dry. If the wall is newly painted, allow it to cure for at least 30 days before applying the wallpaper. Step number four, plan the layout. If your wallpaper has a pattern, plan the layout to ensure the pattern matches seamlessly. Start from the top and center of the wall and work your way outwards. Cut the wallpaper. Cut the wallpaper into manageable strips, adding a few extra inches to the top and bottom for trimming. Peel and stick. Peel a small section of the backing paper from the top of the first strip. Align the top edge with the ceiling or a marked line and start sticking it to the wall. Use the smoothing tool to press the wallpaper onto the wall, working from the center outwards to remove air bubbles. Align and match patterns. For the next strip, align the pattern with the first strip. Overlap slightly if necessary. Then trim the overlap later. Continue peeling and sticking, smoothing each strip as you go. Trim the excess. Use a utility knife or scissors to trim excess wallpaper along the edges such as at the baseboards and ceiling. Smooth out bubbles. After all strips are applied, use the smoothing tool to ensure all bubbles are removed and edges are firmly adhered. Final touches. Stand back and inspect your work. Make any necessary adjustments to ensure the wallpaper is smooth and the pattern is aligned exactly the way you want it to be. Several tips, take your time to ensure each strip is aligned correctly. Use a level to ensure the strips are straight, especially if your walls are not perfectly even. If you make a mistake, peel the wallpaper back gently and reposition it. Following these steps will help you create a beautiful accent wall that transforms your living space. 
Thank you so much for tuning into my channel. Thank you for watching my video. Your support means the world to me. If you enjoyed what you saw, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more exciting content in the future. I appreciate each and every one of you. Until next time. Mwah.